hi guys welcome back to my channel i am tk beauty and in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys the goodies that i picked up during the sephora holiday sale event i did not go ham y'all like i wanted to this year because honey my budget was like mm -mm, not this year but <laughs> i still managed to get a couple of the products that i was interested in and then a lot of the products that i needed so before i show you guys the goodies that i picked up during the sephora holiday event sale if you guys are not subscribed to my channel go ahead and click that subscribe button click that notification bell also so that you will know every time i upload a new video so let's get started with the goodies that i picked up from sephora the majority of the products that i did get i did order online but I still like to go in store to see a couple of the products that I'm interested in so I did go in store there was one product that I wanted that they did not have in store they were sold out so I did order that product um, online I am still waiting for that product to come but I wanted to share it with you guys also that product is the Charlotte Tilbury magic secret skin set I will insert a picture so you guys can see how the set looks but it comes with four decent sized products. I have really been loving Charlotte Tilbury's products lately, so I thought that I would give their skincare a try. This comes with four decent sized products. You get a 15 milliliter magic cream moisturizer. You get an eight milliliter magic serum crystal elixir. You get a 15 milliliter goddess skin clay mask, and then you get a 15 milliliter wonder glow face primer. I am really excited about the magic cream moisturizer. I, I hear nothing but great things about that moisturizer. And I'm also excited about the goddess skin clay mask because I need a clay mask and so i'm really excited to try that one out to see how i like it so let's get started with the other products that i picked up from sephora the first one is going to be by belief this is the belief glowy holiday kit i have heard great things about belief i don't think i've ever tried any of their products if i have it's been so long ago that i don't recall but i wanted to get this set and Sephora has really good deals on their skincare sets. Like this is the perfect time if you're looking to try out any new skincare. This is the perfect time to do so because their sets are really affordable. This set was about $23 and you get about five products in here. And I love this little, uh, little pouch that it comes in. So cute. Um, so let me show you guys the products that come in here. Okay, so the first product that comes in here is going to be the Aqua Bomb Makeup Removing Cleansing Bomb. You guys know that I have been on a cleansing bomb kick lately. And this is how that product looks. So I'm excited to try this out. The next product that I'm really interested in trying out is this Aqua Bomb Sleeping Mask. Yeah, I'm really excited to try out this sleeping mask so yeah i'm excited for this one and then the next item is the true cream aqua bomb i've heard so many people raving about this uh, moisture cream so i can't wait to see how this performs on my skin and then the next item that i got it is the moisturizing eye bomb and i'm excited too to try out a new eye cream so got that and then the last item that comes with this set is the hydration water essence this is how that looks so i think you get a decent amount of product in here for the price like i said this set was 23 dollars, so you couldn't pass that up the next skincare set that i have is by biosense it's the let it glow set and you get two items in here you get the squalene vitamin c rose oil and you get the resurfacing night serum you guys i have already been using this and i can tell you i love both of these products already i can tell you guys right now that i really like this rose this vitamin c rose oil this is really really good i like to put this on after i have moisturized and my skin feels so nice it looks so hydrated and everything i like this so yeah um biosense is one of those brands like i have not really bought any full size of their products except for 
once like a lip product but I would typically get samples of their products when I would go into Sephora but this year I wanted to kind of try out their products because they are really a good brand their products are really really good so I'm excited that I got this set and this wasn't too bad either this was like $25 so I am glad that I got my hands on it I can tell you guys right now that I know I'm going to be repurchasing the full size of this vitamin C rose oil because I really do like it so happy I got this so the next thing I have is the Huda Beauty faux filter skin finish foundation stick and I typically don't buy high-end foundation sticks only because I really like the black opal stick foundations they work really well they're women of color friendly they have a variety of shades for us um, so I really like those they're very inexpensive I think those are like ten dollars but I was curious to try out the Huda Beauty one so I picked it up and you guys it's what I'm actually wearing on my face today and I have to say I really do like this foundation now this is light to full coverage um, but you would definitely have to um, build this foundation up to what you want I went in with two layers of this today and yeah this is what my skin is looking like I like it I like the coverage it's really really pretty I'm in the shade 500 G mocha and it's like a perfect match for me um, this is the packaging of course I've been showing it <laughs> and this is how it looks you have to turn it so this is how the product looks and I do I really do like this product um, so I am glad that I got my hands on it because it's really really nice it's a natural skin like finish so if you're somebody that really want a full coverage foundation this may not be for you I really do like this so I am glad that I picked this up okay the next product that is also by Huda Beauty that I wanted to try when she came out with this this is the water jelly hydrating primer and this is how it looks y'all I use this today also <laughs> And I gotta say, this primer feels really good on the face. It is very hydrating. I really like the way this feels on the skin. And so far, I mean, it does hydrate my skin underneath the um, Huda Beauty Stick Foundation. I am looking a little dewy to me or hydrating, hydrated. <laughs> I mean, so I do, I really do like this primer so far. Now the test with this primer will be how this performs with some of my other foundations but so far y'all so good I am glad that I did pick this up during the sale so yeah the next thing I have is another primer I've been wanting to try this for a while it's by Urban Decay it's the all-nighter ultra glow face primer dewy foundation grip and this is supposed to last up to 12 hours and it's supposed to prep smooth and hydrate the skin I like the Urban Decay All Nighter line and I'm excited to try this out just to see how this primer will work for me. You guys know I saw Hydrate and was like, yes, <laughs> this is for me. This is how that looks. I absolutely love the packaging on this and it is a pump as you guys can see. So yeah, I can't wait to use this. I may use this in a um, tutorial. So stay tuned for that the next thing that I got I know y'all gonna say girl you don't need that but I just thought these colors were just super super gorgeous and this was really inexpensive so I just could not pass on it it's a uh, it's the rare beauty eyeshadow palette in magnetic spirit I love the colors in this these purples are absolutely gorgeous and I like how she has the you are rare on the once you open the packaging can you guys see that it says you are rare I like that little touch this is the eyeshadow palette y'all the packaging on here is so stunning I love it you guys know I live for these purple colors and once you open it it does come with a mirror and what I like too is this little sleeve here that says you are rare I don't know if you guys can see it mine is a little bit on the dirty side I think these eyeshadow colors are absolutely stunning and I'm going to tell you if you guys don't already know you guys should know that purple screamed my name 
this purple screen my name this green screen my name then this orange shade screen my name as well so yeah I just thought this palette was really cute this is not a complete palette though these are a lot of like chromatic shades in here so in order to really have a complete look you would have to use uh, another eyeshadow palette for your crease shade so that's what I did today because I did use this palette today guys and I created this simple look it's not what I was going for but it's what I came out with and so yeah so far I do like the palette these colors are very pigmented I just need to play around with these shades a little bit more okay the next thing that I picked up it's by Biosense this is their squalene plus rose vegan lip balm this is a repurchase for me I really do like this I just use this at nighttime I really like to use this at nighttime it's a little bit on the it's not like super thick but it is thick this is the packaging on that super cute this is how the inside looks I am so excited to have this again because I really do like this. It definitely nourishes and moisturizes my lips, so I'm glad that I picked this up. Another item that I picked up um, from Charlotte Tilbury, it is the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. It says party all night, stay all day. This is supposed to set your, your uh, makeup for 16 hours. It says no melting, no fading, no creasing. Y'all. I have the travel size of this and I did not think I was going to love that product as much as I do but I absolutely love this stuff this is like magic in a bottle it definitely sets your makeup and it does not move I really do like this setting spray and so I wanted to get it in the full size let me open it for you guys so this is how the full size of that look and I'm just excited to have this full size in my collection because like I said this stuff is magic in a bottle it's worth every penny I love this stuff so the best setting spray by far that I have ever used love this okay and then the next item that I picked up it is by fresh this is their rose deep hydration facial toner y'all I should have been picked up the full size of this because I have gone through those travel sizes like water so I picked up the full size this time and I'm so glad that I did this is one of the best toners that I have ever tried and I love this stuff so I can always see me repurchasing this this is how it looks it looks so good but this toner is so hydrating like especially during these fall and winter months like this stuff really really works for my skin okay so now um another item that is a repurchase for me it is the fenty beauty pro filter instant retouch concealer and i am pretty much out of this product um, i think i have a little just a little bit left of the old one but I wanted to go ahead and repurchase this one and this is in the shade 390 I absolutely love the coverage of this foundation I love how it looks underneath the eyes it's pretty much what I'm wearing underneath my eyes today I love this concealer this is one of my favorite high-end concealers so I had to have this so I repurchased that and then I have a couple of lippies that I've been wanting to try out the first one is by Patrick Ta I've been wanting to try out one of his lip glosses I just yeah I didn't know which one I was torn between she's expensive and she's an influencer and I think I would like she's an influencer but I couldn't really swatch it in store to see how glittery that was and so I just went with the safer <laughs> option <laughs> I went with she's expensive and it's just a pretty like champagne color I don't know if you guys can see the name it's a really pretty just simple gloss you can it's like a, a almost like a lip gloss topper when you swatch it it just looks like a regular gloss but you can this is a versatile product this is how it looks yeah this is how it looks it's kind of like a champagne -y gloss with you can see like flecks of glitter and stuff in it and to me it's a versatile product you can kind of use this lip gloss with a brown liner or by itself or as a 
topper for you know a lipstick or something but I am gonna swatch it for you guys but the swatch is just gonna look like a regular gloss and these smell kind of minty it has that minty scent to it but that's how it looks there just like a regular gloss like you can't even really tell like it's a champagne type of color but we're gonna see how this works and then the next gloss that I have it is by tower 28 I've heard so much about this brand about their glosses so I thought that I would try it out so I got mine in the shade cashew this is the packaging on that and again I have it in the shade cashew and this is how the gloss looks and I'm gonna swatch this for you guys so you can see very pretty color this is like an everyday gloss as well can you guys see that that's it right there really really pretty really gorgeous so yeah i got my hands on it and it's also what i have on today and i paired it with a liner that i'm getting ready to mention to you guys so yeah i mean just a pretty simple everyday kind of gloss and it's not sticky which i really like and i do like the color of this you can definitely wear this by itself or you can use it with a liner like i did today so i'll apply some some more so you guys can kind of see it that's just the everyday type of gloss you know you don't want to have to think about what you're gonna wear just throw this on and go so I do like it I picked up the Sephora collection gel liner in molasses I've heard Andrea Renee talk a lot about this lip liner and I have tried other lip liners from the Sephora collection and honestly I have not been in love with them but I will say that I did use this lip liner today and I really do like it it glides on really nicely this is how it looks and I'm gonna swatch it for you guys if that's how it looks there really pretty ri really rich brown the pigment is nice and I did um, use it today before I went in with that tower 28 lip gloss and I must say I do like this color so I think maybe with the other liners that I got from Sephora maybe I just did not like the color but the formula of this one um, I do like I do like the color and I like how easy this glides on so definitely glad I picked this up but I do want to share with you guys some of the products that I got by using my point so the first item is this Biosense Squalene Algae Eye Cream and again I am excited to have some new eye creams in my collection and yeah this is how it looks i think this is a cute little tiny jar just enough product for you to try out the eye cream to see if you like it this was a hundred points i have been using this um, and so far i really do like it so i can't wait to get more use out of it to see if this is really working for me but i'm definitely happy that i picked this up and then another product that i picked up with my points is the youth to the people two-step power facial you get the superfood cleanser and then you get the exfoliation power toner i have been wanting to try out youth to the people for a while but i guess i just never really did my research on them or anything because i just thought it was really a brand that was geared more towards people who had oily skin but when i saw that sephora had this i was like oh i'll use my points to um to try this out this was 250 points and y'all i love this stuff it's gonna do the job it's just gonna cleanse your skin it's not super scented it's not scented really at all so i really like this i've been going through this stuff can you guys see that like i've been using this stuff this stuff works really good on my skin it foams up really nicely and it just leaves my skin feeling really clean and i like that and then <laughs> this this toner y'all I've been using this stuff <laughs> this is about gone but I I will definitely pick up the full size of both of these because I really do like this brand I'm really excited to try other products from this brand I like this stuff so much y'all that I got a another 
um, another one using my points so like I said these were 250 points and I think you could only get these in store so yeah I, I definitely when I'm done with this I'm I'm definitely going to look into getting the full size of both of these products because these are really really good products now the one thing I will say is that the toner does leave my skin feeling sticky after I've applied after I've applied it to my skin but that does go away once you start applying your other products and stuff but I don't like the sticky feeling that is the one downside downside to this toner I don't like the sticky feeling but I still like the way that this performs on my skin so I am really happy that I use my points to get this the last product that I use I think this was a hundred points this is the Moroccan oil treatment I really like to use this stuff in my hair and I just picked up another one because I saw that I could get use my points for it so I thought why not so I got this I really do like this on my hair it gives my hair a nice pick-me-up especially when it's looking dry and stuff I just put a little bit of this in my hair and it just makes it come to life so really like this again this was a hundred points and I'm glad that I use my points to get this as well so yeah guys those are all of the products that I ended up getting this year doing the Sephora holiday event sale like I said I pretty much got some things that I really wanted to try and some things that I was kind of interested in as well so I hope you guys enjoyed this video comment down below and let me know if you guys have shopped the sale um, and let me know what products you guys picked up and how you're loving them I hope you guys enjoyed this video guys and I will see you guys in my next video Bye guys.